Mary Elizabeth Lease was an activist in Kansas working for underdogs. She had been trained as a school teacher. She had become a licensed attorney. But by the summer of 1890, she was making money as a lecturer. She had become known for making speeches about women's rights and for labor unions. And when she saw farmers in the early 1890s struggling the way she and her husband had struggled when they lost their business, she took on that fight. Farmers were working incredibly hard and producing a great bounty for the nation, but they weren't getting the financial benefits of all their hard work. She said, this isn't fair. The bankers on Wall Street are making all sorts of money on the backs of the men and women in Kansas, and we need to do something about this. As a woman in Kansas, she wasn't able legally to run for political office but she was this very well-known lecturer and speaker. And so in the summer of 1890, Mary Elizabeth Lease travels around the state to stump for a third party called the Kansas People's Party that was the populist party. Lease was in on the ground floor of this populist movement. 